off their race and uh, Sav came out fast in front. Grabbing the lead, Sayuri. Sav relaxes to second. And coming through on the inside, Miss Ariel with Golden Vision. Royal Wedding on their outside and last early, London Derry. As Sayuri completely takes command early on. And Sayuri, as they head out the stretch, is the leader by two lengths to Sav. Third, Miss Ariel. Royal Wedding up on the outside. Golden Vision back to second last. And London Derry is the trailer. Making place, Sayuri by about three lengths to Sav. A length to Miss Ariel on the inside as Sav now crosses to tuck in a little bit. And back in fourth placing is Royal Wedding, who's about four lengths off the lead. And second last, Golden Vision. The trailer is Londonderry. And the first quarter was a sluggish one. And out in front, Sayuri in the back stretch. It is Sayuri by a length and a half to Sav. And Miss Ariel with the ears pricked a length away. Third traveling nicely, coming up on the inside of Sav. And tracking them is Royal Wedding. Second last, Golden Vision. And two lengths away last is Londonderry. Racing towards the half mile in the La Prevoyante. And Sayuri the leader. A length and a quarter, Sav. Miss Ariel the inside. A length and a half to Royal Wedding. Golden Vision the rail. And last remains Londonderry. There's been no change. And Sayuri sprints off. Off again, Sav trying to make the sprint with this leader. They broke out by two and a half to Miss Ariel, and on the outside, Royal Wedding, and a break to Golden Vision. And last is Londonderry. After that slow tempo, it's a sit and sprint as they go to the quarter. And still in front, Sayuri Sav trying to reach deep to get alongside, and Royal Wedding targets both of them down the outside. They come down the stretch, and still in front, Sayuri Sav is all out to get the lead, but has got it now. Royal Wedding is back in third, and Sav breaks away at the 16th pole. In second placing is Sayuri, and Sav is going away from them to win. Golden Vision late, and Sav at the wire. Uh, tucks in to win a length, Sayuri, Golden Vision, and Royal Wedding in the La Prevoyante. Back second last, Londonderry, Miss Ariel was last, 145.79. Well, they say when you cash a check, you have to cash on the dotted line, and I want to get this guy's check next weekend because it's been a couple of good days for Justin Stein after a stakes victory yesterday and a stakes win today with Sav, and nicely prepared by Ricky Griffith as well. Uh, Ricky, a one-time former rider, former assistant to Mark Cassie, doing a great job as a trainer as well. Let's talk about Sav here, Justin, because first time going around two turns, you're never sure how much of a key was it to get her to relax in this race. I wasn't too concerned. When I rode her the first time, she was really... She settled, um, she was really comfortable early in the race, and today, you know, I just put my hands down on her, and she was pretty happy sitting where she was. She just hit a stride in the rhythm, and, you know, when she's going easy like that, she's saving energy for the run down the lane. Could you tell early on, the pace was so slow in this race, could you tell that they were pretty much crawling up front? Yeah, I mean, when I saw Patrick dart out of there, I knew he was trying to get an open, open lead and, and then back it up, back the pace up a bit. But, I was, I was just happy where we were. I imagine you have to be thrilled. I mean, you come here late in the season, and uh, now you picked up a couple of stakes wins. Uh, are things going even better than planned? Uh, they're, my expectations were just to come here and ride and have a, have a good, good time. And um, it was pretty overwhelming, the support that I've had from the people that I rode for before when I, before I left. And coming back to that is, um, I came back to open arms. It was pretty awesome. Enjoy this victory, my friend. It's been a great couple of days. Thank you. Let's now bring in the coach, this being Ricky Griffith. And uh, Ricky, this horse just seems to get better and better with each and every race. Pedigree-wise, from the same family as Cooler Mike, did you have any concerns about two turns? I had some concerns, but thanks to S S Steve Duffield, he was, um, it was his call. What can you say about the overall development with this horse, too? I mean, at the start of the season, ran some good races, but the last race was fantastic, and uh, today to stretch out like that, it just seems like this horse is getting better. She's getting better. She's getting better. She's um, very easy to be around, and it's been a pleasure. Ricky, congratulations, my friend. Always nice to Thanks. see in the stakes winner circle. Thank you. Thank okay, you. there you go. Ricky Griffith with Sav. Love Provo on stakes at a low, low price. The favorite does not disappoint. Coming up next, the start of the pick four.